When I first saw these pictures, I didn't know what the Veil of Kashmir was, and I certainly didn't understand what went on there. The Veil of Kashmir is a place. It's a section of Prospect Park, the largest park in Brooklyn. You know, what goes on there is considered by those partaking to be somewhat secret, you know, sort of a, a closed society. And I wanted to help sort of contextualize the photos that Thomas produced with the erotics that actually takes place in the park. The place has been known to me since the early 1970s as a cruising place, a place men go to meet and uh, get involved sexually, romantically. There are many ways people can meet nowadays. And there's something about cruising that I find uh, romantic and beautiful. I'm always looking for a point of entry. Um, how can I engage uh, the, the place, the psychology? I use a rather large camera of my own manufacture and Every one of these photographs were between <coughs> one and six second long exposures. I was standing there with the camera on the tripod and people also approached me. This was not only working very slowly because I decided to, but also engaging the people in the pictures to be uh, part of that collaboration that they would have to hold very, very still. I can't think of another a project where the people and the trees are put together and held in balance like that. After spending all these years of my, of my life photographing essentially urban environments or architecture or whatever, um, just having the opportunity to photograph nature um, was overwhelming to me. a connection to what we are, you know, the our irreducible selves. We don't exist outside of nature. And maybe where we elect to come together says a lot about us. Having taken photographs of the space and seeing the park as important as, as a space and as a almost as a personage, it is it's sort of brilliant. I actually think people's uh, sexual orientation is not that interesting. Um, I'm very interested in men. I, I, um, I happen to have existed as a man for quite a long time now. This was, uh, this was where I wanted to be and these are the people who I wanted to be part of my life story. Every one of my photographs, every and any of the, the books I've done, every one of those people are characters in the, the, the novel that I've been writing from the beginning.